come here with this morning, my name remains Comrade Jonas Amdidi Akbala, one of Niger Delta Strifers. First, I want to appreciate God who have kept us to see this wonderful day. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Depending on the time and location you are tuned to our channel, so we want you to just listen to this uh, broadcast. We'll see you on the other side. We also want to appreciate God for his wonderful work on the life of our great CEOs and our families. I came this morning to call on UAAG management led by Apostle Dr. Kevin Kama to listen up our disbursement. Last week I was called that we should give them this week by the special grace of God that this week money we enter our our phones a lot start ringing. That does not mean that we the freedom fighters we are going to relent because we have had enough. Sportsmen have been lingering since December to date. We have not seen anything. I think these uh, strike force or whatever they call them, they are not striking anything. They have always, always been telling them every week disbursement, every week disbursement, and they are not taking actions. Anyway, let's continue. So, I want to tell the UAAG, the UAAG, because you are the people that verified us. You are the people that we know. You people have to rise up, meet your so-called government authority or government committee <laughs> to make sure that this money get to us. Let me also inform you that the eagle eyes are watching and the government committee hear me and hear me very very clearly. My name is Comrade Jonas Yagbal and one of Niger Delta. We have been informed that the fresh schedule have been sent in order to make the Nigerian mass smile. But I want to let you know the committee that it's not making us smile. What is due for us must be given to Nigerian masses. That which is due for the Nigerian masses should be given to Nigerian masses. Anything less you give me or you give us the reason. Because I know that beneficiary money is specified, CEO money is specified, the bundle money is specified. So that is that for you. It, Because the masses, the Niger Nigerian masses will never take it lightly. Do the right thing at the right time so that at the end of this government, we all will smile and we give you, we praise you. But for now, we are not praising any human being because we want the right thing to be done. Thank God in this country we have the ICPC, the FCC, the government agency. So, I want to let you know. Secondly, 
I'm calling all the Geno Freedom Fighters to join me on this fight. I'm also calling on all the CEO to be part of this great battle. This money belongs to all of us. It's not a balance money, neither UAG money, neither government committee money, or EGPGN money. This money belongs to all Nigerians. All Nigerians. So I want to urge every one of us to be part of this fight. We have given them this week. Today is Sunday. Let them finish their work and let us get a lot this week. If we didn't see money this week, they have to give us the reason why we didn't see money this week. And it must be a genuine reason. It must be a genuine reason. So, Freedom Fighters, my number is all over the social media. I'm calling on all the lawyers that are involved in this UAG grant. I'm calling on all the governors, the senators, the House of Reps, all calibers of professionals. They are part of these grants. <laughs> mm. Please contact me. We will never relent until we see a lot in our phones. <laughs> mm. The press conference is going to hold. You didn't see money this week. Yeah. Except they give us a genuine reason why the money did not drop. <laughs> we don't care to know your vetting, we don't care to know your calculation. All now, all, all Nigeria wants now is disbursement. A lot in our phones. And for those of you who are in Abuja, extorting people here and there. <laughs> Make sure that you pay them all. Because if you don't pay them their money, they will come after you. And again, those of you who have been subscribing up to this moment, know whom you are subscribing to. Because after now, some people will start calling me, Agbala, Agbala, Bego, come go fight my battle. Verification is over. Some of you are still paying money to set of people you don't see your disbursement you call them and take your money back from them <laughs> i don't fight every battle <laughs> they have done verification no they are still collecting money they are still paying money to people so you have to be very very vigilant Nigeria listening to me and listening to me. There is no going back. Please contact me. This fight is not for only Agbala and one. This fight belongs to all of us. See, you, those of you that don't want to come up to join us, if there are no disbursement, we are going to float all the rest you, your beneficiary. We come after you. Some of you people have collected more than enough. You have collected money from your beneficiary, your 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 cluster heads get ready to pay them without one bundle <laughs> because for now it's only one bundle i don't know whether the committee are going to increase but i'm making an appeal to the committee if there is any way or the government authority to increase the bundle you can do that for the masses because people have suffered a lot they are spending so much of their money, they have sold their cars, houses, their land to subscribe on this grant. And finally, I want to talk on this other new grant that came on board, the Power of Five. He promised us last month, we are still waiting for you to disburse to Nigerians. <laughs> there is another one, we call it Special Life Empowerment Program. People are subscribed to your grant. We have not seen anything up to now. <laughs> Yesterday I made the contact. You are telling me that you are still collecting. You better round up your collection. Nigerians are dying. Nigerians are waiting for you. Better do that fast. Then Mama Supreme, get ready for us. <laughs> Mama Supreme, Emily Joyce, 
you have scammed Nigerians. The evil eyes will come after you. We, the Nigerian masses, will come after you. Immediately after the disbursement of you, they are promising us we are coming after you. Better prepare your house. The Tepicon grants, mm. the liberation grants, mm. we have not forgot you people. Oh. All the grants that extorted Nigerian masses, get ready for our Bala and his team. We are coming after you one after the other. Mm, I hope this is not you pay us only vant. our money. You promise us that you have a grant. People have sold their properties to subscribe. This grant, you have bought houses here and there, enjoying your life while Nigerian masses are dying. I will be the last man to extort Nigerians. I will continue to stand by the masses. Mm -hmm. That is my assignment. Okay. All these grants that extorted Nigerians in one way or the other, get ready for the fight too. Okay. We are going to fight you. We are going to follow you up. We have promised Nigeria you extorted us. So I'm not exempting any grant to, until I see money, until we see money in our, our lap. UAAG, you better call your committee and do something fast before it gets out of hand. Thank you for listening to me. Okay, guys. Thanks a lot. See you at the other next update. A lot of things are unfolding. Bye guys, see you.